On Tuesday, August 1st at 4 p.m. Central Time, meet an aneurysm patient and hear from highly regarded specialists about the treatment options for aneurysms, a potentially deadly brain condition. If an aneurysm breaks or bleeds, that results in something called a subarachnoid hemorrhage or bleeding into the space surrounding the brain. That is a life-threatening condition um, and a large number of patients can experience sudden death as a result of that happening. During the webcast, the doctors will evaluate the patient's case and show you state-of-the-art treatment options for aneurysms called clipping and coiling. The primary way the coil works is, or, is that we are mechanically filling this saccular outpouching that shouldn't be there with metal coils. And what that does then, it, it generally prevents blood from getting into the aneurysm. And, and in doing so, then if blood can't get into the aneurysm effectively, then it can't leak out of the aneurysm. The aneurysms that we uh, treat that are not treated with coiling are treated with what's called a craniotomy. We actually make an opening in the skull, cutting a window that's all replaced uh, and reconstructed at the end of the procedure. That allows us to work underneath the brain where most of these aneurysms are located. And then we take a small titanium, typically, clip that looks like a clothespin and opens and closes like a clothespin. And we use it to essentially uh, pinch off the aneurysm, reconstructing the normal blood vessel. You, the viewer, can send in your questions to the surgeons via email during the procedure. Please join us on August 1st at 4 p.m. Central Time to view a panel discussion on treatments for brain aneurysms live from St. Joseph's Hospital in St. Paul, Minnesota.